So the idea behind this pedal board setup is to make as much use out of as few pedals as possible. Uh, at least ways as far as of what I have available. So all this together should create a system that you can pack and go inside of a, a pedal train case and go play a gig without an amplifier. There may be situations that arise where it doesn't make sense to take one of your tube amps out with you, so maybe you might want to take something that's more portable and probably won't break your heart as much if something grows legs. So we've been talking about the Quilter Super Block US a little bit lately, and um, you can hook this up straight through a PA. It's actually a little bit better if you can hook it up through a PA as opposed to using a external cabinet. It just it just sounds better. In this setup, from here you would go into either your mixer or directly into a powered speaker, depending on how light you want to pack. We're going to be using for this example the Keeley Dark Side. The Electro Harmon X Crayon for your overdrive. The uh, Mini C for compression by Musky. Um, also the Reverb Machine by Behringer. The idea here is you hook your guitar cable into the compressor. You send your signal out into your overdrive and then you feed this into your Keeley dark side. So the reason why I'm using the Keeley dark side for this is it has a fuzz section which creates a good distortion. Uh, you've got your flange, you've got your phase, and you also have delay. So you can get your chorus effects through this, you can get delay, you can get your distortion. Do all that with one pedal and it sounds amazing. This is marketed as a pedal to make you sound like David Gilmore, but you can get an awesome Guns N' Roses tone out of this. You can, I mean, you can get a good slash tone out of this. There's a lot of great tones that you can get out of this one pedal. Uh, you can use this even for CCM. You can use this as both a dirty overdrive and as a transparent overdrive and of course compression is always great and this is really a great reverb so I've dialed in a really good uh, setting that you can get a lot of options out of this one setup we're going to hook it up into a uh, powered speaker and we shall return with some sound samples all right, so let's turn on the compression. The uh, reverb's already on.
the tone to your liking but this is just how I have it set up for right now if you got any value out of this video please give a comment drop a like and I will see you next time take care